What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black Walkthrough. Okay, alrighty, so in the last episode, we got our seventh badge. Mm hmm. And now, this is where things are gonna get a little real because it's always on the seventh badge. I don't know, and storylines always hit the seventh badge. And look at that, our good old buddies, uh, Bianca and. Not, not you, Jaren, you're not our buddy, you're just some dude and whatever. Draven, I've been talking to Bianca, and I'm wondering. Since we left Nuvemba town, has something about me changed? Yeah, you... No, actually, no. Still the same thing. Still questioning yourself, saying that I want to be strong, but yet... I don't know. I really... Seriously, you... Yeah, there's nothing different about you, man, except for the haircut, probably. I don't know. Or the time. I don't, you know what? I'm just bum I'm bumbling right now. Thinking about what I want to do, thinking about what I should do. I felt like there was nothing. There really isn't, okay? Have I really become stronger? Nope. Or is it just my Pokemon have? Your Pokemon have got stronger, but not you. I don't know anymore. Hey, hey, cheer up, Charon. Isn't it nice to see everyone? Yeah, it is. It's nice to see you, not you, Charon. Draven, know what? This time, I'll go to the Pokemon fan club. I'm really searching for what I want to do and what I can do. And here comes Bryson, and he's like, who are you? Who? Us? I'm Bianca, and this is Charon. I know, I know you are there. Why? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Homeboy here is like, I know you are there. Why don't you show yourselves? The hell? And bam! The ninjas came out. Oh, damn. These guys are stealthy. Impressive. Gym leader of Istra City. We, the Shadow Triad, are beings of the shadows. Not easily noticed. Our mission was to speak only with Draven, but... So be it. Getsis has a message for you. Come to Dragon Spiral Tower. It is there that our Lord N waits for you. Now, our mission is complete. Dragon Spiral Tower? What is going on? Hey, tell me! Bam, they leave. Holy crud, holy crud. Now hang on. Young man, if you are here for a gym challenge, hang on for a bit. I've got to head to, or have to, head, uh, to the Dragon Spiral Tower. I'm going to. Dragon Spiral Tower is north of here, right? Yeah, it is, but it, why do you have to always come to where we need to go? God dang. Okay, so let's see. Whoa, whoa! What should I do? For I have to go to uh, Dragon Spiral Tower. Okay, I'm heading north. Alright, well, we're going to be heading north to the Dragon Spiral Tower. And the name says it all, guys. It is filled with dragons. And I was thinking about it. I really was thinking about uh, capturing a dragon over there, but my team is set. It really is. Uh, I'm really liking it, and I don't know if I can, like, part ways with one of my Pokemon right now. Now, Bianca's like, hey, Draven! The hell? The hell? What does, what's, what's, what's going on right here? Let's see. Okay. Uh, oh, look at that. It's, uh, it's Cedric right here. Oh, Draven! And you must be Bianca. I'm the other Juniper, Professor Juniper. The Professor Juniper who gave you the Pokédex is my daughter. Nice to meet you, Professor. Thanks to Professor Juniper, I got to go on an adventure and start figuring out possibilities for my life. I'm very, very grateful for, uh, for her. Is that right? Grand, grand. Actually, we should chat later. Draven, Bianca, here's the situation. Some members of Team Plasma, quite a large group, broke through the tower wall and went inside. Bryson and the young man, I believe his name is Jaren, the two of them went after them, or Team Plasma, but... Professor, what? what's the Dragon Spiral Tower? Huh, I guess, you would uh, I guess you would be curious. Well, I'll explain briefly. Dragon Spiral Tower has stood tall since long before Unova was founded. On top of the uh, on top of the floor, the legendary dragon type Pokemon waits for a person pursuing ideals to appear. And that's what it is said. Are you going to go after Team Plasma like your friend did? It's admirable that you joined the fight against Team Plasma, but it's it's risky too. Don't worry, Draven and Sharon are both really really strong, and they've got they've they, they've beaten Team Plasma before. But I'm not that I'm not all that strong. Actually, I admit it, I'm not very strong. So. I was thinking it would be nice if uh, maybe I could uh, stay here and be your bodyguard. Don't be a chicken, baby. Come on. Come with me. Why, thank you. That makes me feel so much safer. Well, Draven, it's up to you. Climb, the, climb up the tower. 
this is this is or this is all I could give you, but it might help you uh, might might help you rest. Look at that, we get ourselves the old Jatu, Jatau. Jatau, Jatu, Jatau, I didn't even know how to pronounce that stuff. Still, what could the Team Plasma be after? A dragon type Pokemon. Okay, so here we go. Let's go to the Dragon Spiral Tower, and of course, they're gonna be waiting for us. So let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. I think the next Pokemon that needs a little bit of love is Drillmonger. He's going to destroy everyone. Oh wow, he didn't want to battle us. Earlier, the gym leader went up to the tower. If you're lucky, you might witness a legend. Okay, alrighty. So here we are, and uh, wow. This is crazy. This is pretty crazy right here. So here we are in the Dragon Spiral Tower. Again, like I said, you will be finding some pretty good uh, dragon type power, uh, Pokemon right here. And we're going to meet one of them right now. Not this guy, Golette. Now, Golette is a pretty cool Pokemon. It is both Ghost and Dr uh, ghost and Ground type Pokemon. New capabilities. I was thinking of using them, but eh, I don't know. It's a little too late in the game for my taste right here. So, we're going to be using a few Max Repels because we don't want to get attacked by any of these Pokemon. Alright, let's take care of it. Let's see. And, uh, what the hell's going on? The hell? Is... Is something going wild at the top of the tower? Probably. Okay. And of course, Jerry Charan is like, Draven! Oh, there you are. You can walk on the Fallen Columns too! I'm going after Team Plasma. Oh yeah, always have to be the hero, but... Uh, you're not really the hero until you can beat the champ right here. I'm just saying. Alright, so let's go right ahead and use some uh, strength to move by... You know, get get through this whole area pretty quickly, and there will be some well, there will be some areas right here that's gonna be a little confusing. Hopefully, this won't take as long. And here we found ourselves a hyper potion, and let's see, let's see, dowsing machine, and nope, nothing right here. Always use the dowsing machine, guys. You probably find some uh, cool items along the way. So let's go right ahead and grab this, and look at that, Stardust. It's another money maker right there. That way we can. Uh, Buy some other other stuff too. So here we are in the Dragon Spiral Tower, and look, it's spiraling out of control. And there is a puzzle that we need to solve right here. And well, we're gonna try everything. As you can see, this sends me all the way back, so that probably wasn't the best idea. So let's go to number two, and this will actually lead us to the item up here. Look at that. Find ourselves a shiny stone. Which will enable us to evolve a certain Pokemon. It doesn't really matter what Pokemon it is. If there was a Pokemon, it could evolve with that. So here we go. Actually, if you had a Curly on this game, yes, you can actually evolve it into... Yeah, Gallade right there. So Let's go ahead and uh, use another Max Repel and get the heck up here. This is not the end of the whole trip. I think there's like five stories of this place. And you're still going to have to battle some Team Plasma members. God dang it. Alright, so once you get over here, you got Bryson, he's like, Draven, we'll hold him off here. You go ahead. Why, yes. And Sharon's like, this is nothing, but there sure a lot of, there sure are a lot of them. Oh, what a complete bother. That's all he can say. What a complete bother. Screw it. Let's see. Yeah, alright. If I have to lose, at least it has to be, at least it, or at least it's to the gym leader. That's true, that's very, very true, but still, we still gotta battle some people right here, so let's go right ahead and battle this guy. Bryson, Jaren, they're moving around being annoying. Okay, so they're they're being annoying. Jaren's being a little bit annoying right now. For a while, I, I, I've grown to dislike the guy, probably because he's just like, he's just too annoying. Just too freaking annoying, but here we go, Watchog. Okay, you... Mysterious, mischievous looking Pokemon right here. Let's go right ahead and use Earthquake. Let's get this. Oh, yes. And there goes Watchog. One Pokemon, one hit. KO. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's uh, that's how you do a Pokemon battle right there. Now, we got another one right here. Let's see what she has to say. I will hurt anyone who disobeys Team Plasma. Well, this Pokemon trainer. Is not not that scary right here. So here we go, another Team Plasma Grunt wants to battle us, and she will be coming out with her Lifer. 
Hey, this Pokemon right here doesn't scare me either. I got the right Pokemon. Real monger. Says it in the name. Lyper Destroyer. So here we go. Earthquake attack. Let's get it. Oh, yes. And there goes Lyperd. Okay, like I said, Ly Lyper Destroyer. Destroys and Gigalith grows to level 41. And it's learning Air Slash. Okay, let's see what kind of a move this is. Okay, so we got Air Cutter. And Air Slash. Okay, just a little bit stronger. So we're going to take away that. Alrighty, okay. So there we go. And now we can move on ahead right here because we got some more Pokemon trainers to battle. I think there's like, oh crud, another one right there. So let's move on ahead and use Ace now. Now off screen I did teach him a new move and it's Thunderbolt, so that's awesome. And let's see, I'm sure you want to. You also thought I'm strong and I can win, and I can't and came here. Well, I am strong and I can win, so you're pretty much screwed right here. There we go, Team Plasma Grunt wants to battle, one Pokemon, and she does, or he does have a Scraggy right here. Alrighty. Let's go right ahead. Alright, Thunderbolt for the win. Look at that. I'm actually happy that we went through that other area, that area close to Nuvemata, because never would have thought that, the, that you can actually find yourself a, uh, well, you can find yourself TM24 or the HM uh, Waterfall, which is very, very beneficial right there. So look at that. Ace grows to level 41, and bam. Everybody's growing in levels, feeling good about themselves and all that crud. So let's see. Another Pokemon trainer. Let's give another another Pokemon a shot right here. Let's go with Sigh of the Torrent, level 50 man, and let's just destroy him. Okay, here we go. What do you have to say? We exist to serve our Lord in. Okay, here we go. Team Plasma ready to battle. And it's a female. She's got two Pokemon right here. Coming with a life herd. I got myself Sigh of the Torrent right here. Alrighty. Alright, let's go. Revenge. Let's get this. And, uh, what? Home Claws wanted to... Home Claws, let's go. Here we go. Revenge. I don't know much of a revenge right here. Let's get it. And Lyperd, bam. Defeated. Quickly. Easily. Bam. Oh, yes. And, let's see. Coming out with another Lyperd. I'm just gonna stay put right here with Side of the Torrent. Now, the reason why I... I, well, I, I leveled up Scythe to level 50 because it actually takes off the hassle of my starter Pokemon, you know, trying to grow levels. It'll actually let me focus more on my other Pokemon right here, which it will. And god dang it, that goddamn assurance attack right there. Here we go with Revenge. Okay, here we go. Revenge does it, Lyper defeated. Feeling good about myself here. And everybody's growing levels. Now remember, we did get another experience share at the at the Pokemon Fan Club, and that right there is actually a huge benefit to us, just because you know you get six Pokemon, you only get one experience share in most uh, most versions and all that stuff. But right here, this will actually help you just a little more because there's a little bit more to this story than just you know the Pokemon League and Lord End and all that stuff. Kind of a, it's kind of funny how we never really completed the Pokemon League and all that crud uh, in the last two Pokemon Black walkthroughs they had. So here we go, Watch Hot coming out, and let's get it. Sigh of the Torrent. Okay, so here we go with the Waterfall attack. Now I did teach Sigh of the Torrent Waterfall and took away Surf mainly because it's its stat says that it's a better physical attacker than, than special attacker. It's a combination of both and all that crud. So. You know, I kind of I kind of figured that you know why I have two Pokemon that with Surf. So let's go with Revenge right here, and here comes that Brick Break. How is that Pokemon faster than mine? I want to know. Here we go. Bam! Revenge of the Nerds. There you go. Sigh of the Torn. You are a magnificent bastard, you. And here he comes out with a Crock of Rock. So we're gonna stay put right here with Sigh and Homie here. Both a both a ground and and dark type Pokemon right now. So let's go with a waterfall. See what we got. Oh yes. Waterfall does its trick. 
No more Krunkerunk. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. Look at that. Everybody's getting points. I'm feeling good. My motivation is great. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so that might be not... That's not the last trader, but here we go. Found ourselves a Dragon Fang. And that will actually prove useful for our Dragon-type Pokemon. If we, even, if we even have one. Now, I think this is the last portion of this place right here. As you can see, you're going to have to go in circles just to get through these items right here. So we're going to try our best. Let's see. Go right here. Go right up here. Hold on just a sec. And grab this little bastard right here. So here we have another star Stardust. And now, let's go right down here. And let's see. I think we should have gone... Okay, the repel. Should have gone right here. Let's go right ahead and use another repel. Again, there are a lot of strong uh, Dragon-type Pokemon. Drudigon comes to mind. I actually used them in my last Pokemon uh, Black Walkthrough. Very good Pokemon. It's just it's too late in the game right here to actually have one. And here we have a star piece. So now we're going to go right here. And uh, I'm getting a little dizzy right now. <laughs> okay. And let's see. Where are we? Where? Okay. So we're going to grab this little bastard. Bam. A revive. And that will actually help us out too. Now we're going to have to go up here. And I believe this is the staircase to the next room. And yes. Oh, wow. What the hell is going on? Oh, damn. Okay. It's shocking. It sounds like something is a, on a rampage at the top of the tower. There is something on the top of the tower. Holy crud. Holy crud. All right. Let's grab this. Max Elixir. And let's go right ahead and... Oh, well. Another... Uh, Another gathering of the Team Plasma Elos. And here we go, Giallo. It's finally time, our Lord Anne will become the hero. Oh damn, he's looking at me, he's like, what? Someone made it clear up there, or up here? Now, stop that trainer for our Lord Anne. So it's a four on one battle right here. Holy crap, oh damn. Oh damn, oh damn, okay, so let's see. Everyone who is in Team Plasma is an enemy. Use all your power to take him out. Okay, no one can interfere with our universe new dawn. Alrighty, okay, so it's four against one right here. Now remember in Pokemon Omega Ruby, Alpha Zapphire, you can actually battle four trainers at one time. I remember doing that, and that was actually fun. I don't know why they they didn't add it right here in this uh in this in this game right here. That would have been awesome, just using a surf attack on all four people. That would be great. So here we go, waterfall. Finish this guy. There we go. Watch Hog. Defeated. Bam. Everybody points. And he's going to come out with a Crook Rock. So let's just stay put right here. And keep Sign of the Torrent destroying everybody. And here comes an Intimidate. Ah, oh, crud. Let's go. There we go. Waterfall. Get it. Crook Rock. Defeated right here. Look at that, Pokemon de destroying everybody right here, and look at that, one of them is down. The Dawn of Unova has faded in the distance. Okay, so, sheesh, losing to a kid, but Team Plasma is more than a po one person. Really? Our dream is about to come true. No one will, uh, will be able to stop us. Alrighty. Let's get it. Okay. So here we go, another Team Plasma Grunt wants the battle, and he's coming out with another Krokorok right here. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Let's get with let's get with Sai right here, and let's just destroy this guy here. Waterfall. There we go, waterfall. Oh yes. And that's the end of that story right there. Okay, alrighty, 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 okay. Well, you you weren't that strong. And Team Plasma member right here is like, you may have stopped me, but my teammate will stop you here. Not really. Team Plasma, here I come! Plasma! Now, this, this, this whole group is a cult kind of thing, just like in everybody else. Like in every every other team in the, in the, in the last few walkers and all that stuff. Now, I don't know which team is the craziest. You know, I, I I started to I started playing these games and all that stuff, and I'm try, I'm starting to figure out what like what what the the the, the main theme in the whole walkthroughs is. Uh, you know, if you guys know what I mean. 
think the first one was all like first Pokemon game was science. So Team Team Rocket, of course, was a big old enterprise, or you know, kind of like the Yakuza or any kind of cartel and stuff. I'm not, I'm not kind of like a, <laughs> not, not not going to an extreme, but a Pokemon cartel. That's what they are. And then in Generation Three, you got Team Magma and Team Aqua. You got these two elemental, elemental groups fighting against each other. So I guess it's the elements. Earth, wind, fire, and all that stuff. And then Generation 4, I would like to say it's kind of like religion. I think it is kind of like religion. Could be wrong. Comment down below. And this one right here, I guess it's a yin and yang, so could be wrong. I don't even know that, guys. So here you go. Another Team Plasma member is like, bring it on. Can you take on, a, can you take on four in a row? Yes, I can. Let's get it. Okay, so here we go with another Team Plasma member, and he will be having one Pokemon. Of course, it's just a Wadog. Okay, so here we go. Samurant, I'm ready to kick some ass, tech names, and all that crud, so let's get this revenge. Oh, yes. And, yeah, how is that? Okay, how did he go first? I'm still trying to figure that out. Let's go with the revenge. He did take a lot of HP, and no more Wadog. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so that's four in a row. Beat every single one of them. I don't understand. Why do you keep trying so hard? Well, let let you through right now. Okay, so everybody is let through let me through right here. Now let's go ahead and talk to this guy if he wants to battle. And he's like, the hero will open up the way to the new world. Which means trainers can uh, or which means you trainer can all prepare to lose your Pokemon. Okay. Still, I don't get you guys' uh, methods and all that stuff. So, we're going to be going up here, and as you can see, Anne is going to be standing right there in front of us. And I think the battle has ended. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. That's one scary motherfucker. Holy shit. Red eyes and everything. It's the red eyes black dragon. That's what it is. Okay, so what happened? What do you think, Draven? How do you think, uh, or how do you like the, the powerful form of the Pokemon who appears before and fights beside the hero that will lead the way to, the, to a new world? Oh, damn. Now, Zekrom. And I, or now Zekrom and I will head to the Pokemon League and defeat the champion. This will be the last of the Pokemon battles that will hurt Pokemon so. A world for Pokemon alone. It's finally going to be a reality. Oh, damn. So he captured Zekrom. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. If you want to stop me, you must become a hero as well. That's right. When Zekrom's counterpart, Reshram, recognizes you, we will finally be even. And then you can uh, try and stop us. Well, what will you do? Uh, I think I'm gonna go capture that Pokemon, but where is he? Trying to find, trying to figure that out. My prediction: if the future that I see is true, you will meet Reshiram, the Pokemon with you, uh, with you believe in, or yeah, you know, the Pokemon with you believe in you so strongly. Will you be the one to who interferes in, with my formula for changing the world? If you want to protect the bonds between Pokemon and people, you must search for Reshiram. I'm sure it is waiting for you in a form of a light stone. Hmm. Didn't we see a light stone before? Somewhere? Before? I don't even know. You guys are late. Seriously. Sharon, you, you're always late, man. Come on. Get with the program. Draven, did you see what, I, what flew off just now? How could this happen? Why? That... That was the end guy, right? Why was he on the legendary Pokemon? He couldn't really be the hero, could he? Also, did I hear him tell you to search for another legendary Pokemon? Calm down. First, we go back. It's more important to decide what to do next to it than al analyze what just happened. Alrighty, so... Shit just happened and, uh, well, Charon's still analyzing the whole thing right here. Astounding! I never would have imagined the legendary dragon type Pokemon would return now. That guy called in. Team Plasma's boss apparently reawakened the legendary Pokemon. He told Draven to, uh, to look for for the other legendary Pokemon and then flew away. 
huh? There are two legendary dragon type Pokemon? Yes, yes there are. Oh damn, and oh, what the hell's going on right here? And oh wow, Super Saiyan Akuma is here. Why, if it isn't Alder. It's been a while, how have you been? Well, no time for chit chat. Those violent flashes of lightning that shot from the tower, that Pokemon has the power to destroy the world. If it is on Team Plasma's side, and Team Plasma tells everyone to release their Pokemon, no matter whether it comes from fear or admiration, the world can't, st can't help uh, but change. But it will become a world where we are separated from Pokemon. Right. Moreover, the boss of Team Plasma, N, who will reawaken Zekrom, apparently is said to look for the other Pokemon, Reshiram. If I remember the myth, Zekrom's power could... Zekrom's powerful electricity, along with the other Pokemon, devastated ancient Unova in an, in an instant, even knowing that N is still wanting to awaken the other. Hmm, huh. Isn't it dangerous to bring back a Pokemon that powerful? Miss, you are a, par a very uh, kind person. Still, I don't know if other Pokemon will be able to stand up to it. Because, no matter what, it is a legendary being. I don't like the idea of taking orders from N, but searching for the dragon, the uh, the stone, might not be a bad plan. We certainly can't let Team Plasma reawaken both of them. Since I've traveled all over Unova, I have, I have an idea where it might be. Let's head back to the Relic Castle, Draven. Uh, Draven, everyone, or wait, 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 Draven, everyone, I am going. I see. We'll leave that to you. I'm going to investigate inside the tower. Hopefully, I'll find something then I will go with you. Alrighty, so shit's going on. Shit's going real. Shit's getting real. Holy crud. I think I understand better now. Being able to do something for Pokemon for somebody at a time like this is strength. I'm sure of it. And my strength is something that is given to me by my Pokemon. Okay, champion, let's hurry. Okay, so uh, I guess we're gonna go to the Relic Castle probably, I think. Draven, this has turned into a big deal. So confusing. I don't know what to do. Are you going to go to the Relic Castle, Draven? Past Route 4, the desert or the desert resort, the desert resort. I hear that where the Relic Castle is. Okay, so we've already been to the Relic Castle before, guys. I guess it's time to go back and uh, take care of business over there too. So stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we're going to be doing our little investigation of this whole ordeal right here. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.